Cryogenics Cryogenics is the cooling of materials to extremely low temperatures using highly condensed gases. The shown is used to transport liquefied gases used in cryogenic processes. Cryogenics involves refrigeration at temperatures below 120 Kelvin. These low temperatures, which are not natural on Earth, make it possible to liquefy gases such as methane, oxygen, nitrogen and hydrogen. The cryogenic plant show is used to produce liquefied natural gas. Cryogenic temperatures are generally achieved through a refrigeration cycle. First, the gaseous refrigerant, green, is compressed and heated in a compressor. Next, the compressed refrigerant, red, is cooled. The heating from this cooling process is used in the compressor. The refrigerant then travels through an expansion valve, cooling to the point of condensation. This condensed refrigerant now comes in contact with the material to be cooled, bringing the temperature of the material down to cryogenic temperatures. As it cools the material, the liquid refrigerant is in turn reheated and undergoes the cycle again. Cryogenic system can be modified to fit many situations, such as the storage of the liquid oxygen, as shown. The tank wall materials must be carefully chosen to avoid brittle failure at low temperatures. The piping used for the cryogenic systems is usually insulated by a vacuum, which has poor conductivity. Out wall of this pipe has been cut away so the vacuum chamber and inner pipe can be seen in the picture. A common use of cryogenic technology is the production of liquefied natural gas, LNG, for use as a vehicle fuel. LNG is fed from tanks to the engine through cryogenic pumps. LNG is very cost-efficient and is used by a few metropolitan transportation systems across the United States. The number of LNG fueling systems, known as peak shaving stations rose from 3 in 1965 to approximately 100 in 1997. Cryogenics are used widely in medical and biological processes, such as in blood transplantation. At cryogenic temperatures, air can be separated into pure oxygen, nitrogen, and argon. Liquid nitrogen is used in many processes, such as food preservation. Both units shown here use air separation to supply pure oxygen in the medical field. As with standard refrigeration systems, cryogenic systems can also be installed in vehicles for the transportation of liquefied gases as shown. These are relatively simple systems but hazardous conditions due to low temperatures. High energy required to achieve low temperatures.